Do you remember this video we covered? Yo! After making a racist gesture, security came over to this Badgers fan. Eventually, he was kicked out of the Wisconsin Northwestern game, but not before doing the racist gesture a second time. Finally, he left the arena. Lo and behold, we have an update. This video was viral like a month ago, and what I understood was that Wisconsin Badgers identified who he was and then banned him from any future games. But I've noticed that there's no name put out. It's been a month, and it still says this man has not been identified. And that comes from at that Dinesh guy on TikTok and Twitter, who you should definitely follow on both platforms. That means that the Wisconsin Badgers do know who he is and did not give out that information. Well, I've identified him, and so I know why they haven't given out that information. It's because of his job. And this is exactly why accounts like mine need to exist. Because accountability should apply to everyone, even those that may work for employers like SAP. Man making racist Asian gestures at that game is Eric Kotek. And here's how we know. When Dinesh tagged SAP in his tweet, the company replied with the following, we can confirm the individual in question no longer works for SAP. It is a pitiful, bigoted display from a pitiful, bigoted person, ruining the atmosphere of a college basketball game because he just can't go and not be a racist jerk. As Dinesh points out, this was not the first SAP employee he ID'd. Uh, that's a, um, excuse me? Excuse me, <coughs> I'm coming through. <coughs> <coughs> Remember the coughing Karen in a grocery store at the height of COVID, refusing to wear a mask and intentionally coughing on those, just trying to do their basic shopping? Dinesh broke the news to all of us, including her employer, which happened to be SAP. After the footage went viral, German so the German software company said it would be investigating as it was reported that the woman in the footage was one of its employees, wrote Newsweek. Days later, they confirmed the incident occurred with an employee and that she was no longer a part of the team. But back to Eric. Dinesh wrote, I've received confirmation from other SAP employees that wish to remain anonymous that Eric Kotek was fired from SAP quietly following this incident. Previously, going back to 2013, there was an alleged essay that took place at the Kohl Center from a man with a nearly identical name. The Kohl Center, for reference, is where the Wisconsin Badgers basketball team plays their home games. Eric Lochner Kotek, a 22-year-old UW student, was intoxicated and yelling derogatory obscenities at the opposing team and fans at a basketball game, said UW Police Department spokesperson Mark Lovacott. Lovacott said a security guard witnessed Lochner Kotek slap a female on the backside. Lochner Kotek was charged with fourth-degree sexual assault, battery, and disorderly conduct, he said. The victim was not a UW student, but a female fan who was sitting across the aisle from the suspect, Lavacott would say, wrote the Badger Herald. And after this man was recorded using his middle fingers to pull his eyes back in a taunt to Asian American fans in the Northwestern student section with what is called a slant eye gesture, the University of Wisconsin announced he's no longer welcome at UW athletic events, and they barred him from buying tickets on their platform.